What's up, guys? It's me, Andres Rodriguez, otherwise known as Anne One from the Combat Cousins. And today is the day to try out Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Unfortunately, it's a demo, and this is part two of it, by the way. I made the last one, and I didn't really get that far. I didn't get scared by any, any of Freddy's freaking animatronic buddies, or Freddy himself. But, it will not stop me from trying out again. So without further ado, let's begin. Woo! And guess what? This time, I... Am go let this guy answer the call. Here we go. Uh, hello, hello, hello. Uh, hello, and welcome to your new summer job at the new and improved Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Bullshit. Uh, I'm here to talk you through some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here, and to help you get started down this new and exciting career path. Uh, now I want you to forget anything you may have heard about the old location. Oh, great. What? They walk? Oh. Fuck. You should be. Not. No! Mainly he expressed concern that certain characters seem to move around at night and even attempted to get into his office. Now, from what we know, that should be impossible. Uh, that restaurant should be the safest place on Earth. So while our engineers don't really have an explanation for this, the working theory is that the robots were never given a proper night mode. So when it gets quiet, they think they're in the wrong room. So then they go try to find where the people are, and in this case, that's your office. Our temporary solution is this. There's a music box over by the fire counter and it's ready to be wound up remotely. So every once in a while, watch over to the prize counter video feed and wind it up for a few seconds. It doesn't seem to affect all of the animatronics, but it does affect one of them. <laughs> uh, and as for the rest of them, we have an even easier solution. You see, there may be a minor glitch in the system, something about robots thinking you as an endoskeleton without a cop. Thanks, uh, asshole. And leave it on for as long as you want. Eventually, anything that wandered in will wander back out. Uh, something else worth mentioning is kind of the quirky modern design of the building. You may have noticed there are no doors for you to close. <laughs> uh, but hey, you have a light, and even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building cannot. So don't worry about the place going dark. Well, I think that's it. Uh, you should be golden. Uh, check the lights, put on the pretty head if you need to. Uh, keep the music box wound up, be the case. Have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Thank God that fucking asshole shut the fuck up. And why am I doing this fucking job for only a hundred dollars and fifty cents? I should be paid a million dollars, nigga! Or better yet, give me the whole damn doll that you have still left in your fucking safe. Or at least everything they ever honest dollar you've ever conned at people for staying here and being a fucking security guard. While they're scared at night cause those fucking animatronics are gonna kill them and stuff them in a fucking Freddy Bear suit. Really nigga? I wish the guy could strangle that motherfucker that did this to me. I'm a fucking security guard working like this because I'm forced to. Either that, or I just thought it was a good idea the fact that I could, I can give you like paid a hundred dollars and fifty cents just for staying five nights. Whichever the case, 
And if it's the second part of it, then I'm a fucking idiot for that. Yeah. Anyways, let's check this shit out. Without further ado. So far... So... Oh, shit. Where you go? There you are! Hey, Bonnie! How you doing? You're in the party section? That's good! Stay there, you bastard! Oh, shit. God. Okay, good, you're still there. They're still there. Okay. Okay. Oh, crap, no. 4 p.m. Um, shit. I'm at 4 a.m., sorry. It's night one so far, and I got three batteries left, and I gotta power up this fucking wind-up music box. This is stupid, but at least I'm lasting so far. Oh, sh Shit. Okay, they're still there. Shit. Where? Where? No. Where's Bonnie? Oh, fuck. Okay, good. No! No! Oh god, I hate that sound! I hate that sound! Okay. I should be fine. Ah! Oh, hi, Bonnie! How you doing? Kill me! I'm just a friend! Okay, you bastard. After I wind up this fucking music box, I'm gonna keep my eye on Bonnie. I'm watching you, motherfucker. I'm watching you. Through the camera. I'm still watching you! Okay. STILL WATCHING YOU, FUCKER! Oh god, I got two batteries left. Man, they haven't moved a muscle. But, uh, hey, who am I to complain? At least I, I only got one to worry about. YES! THANK YOU! Oh, YES! I survived the night of one for a go. Hopefully it can last that long. Oh! I forgot, it's just a demo. <laughs> okay. That was just one night. Alright guys, that was just a demo. <laughs> I got carried away, think I had four nights left to go. Because, you know, it seems so much like the actual thing. Like the real inst one instead of the demo. Well, thank God it's just a demo. Oh God. I know you have to buy the real thing with money, both part one and two, but God, if that's what's going to be like in the demo, I hate to think of what it's going to be like in the real thing when I buy it or when I go on the computer and such. Yeah. Okay, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching that. And also, thank you so much for the 1,100 and something views. I'm saying something because I can't really estimate how much, but I know it's near that. Or more than that, actually, but... Still, ever so kindly, thank you. Okay, bye guys. Please like this video. Comments down below. Subscribe to me, Andres Rodriguez. Tell me what you think. And please, keep it real, guys. Oh, yeah. See ya. This is M1 signing out. Peace.